President-elect Trump has spoken with several world leaders. The Kremlin says Trump has spoken to President Putin and discussed Syria and Russian relations. In the meantime, Trump also spoke to the Chinese president after targeting China often on the campaign trail. Trump has railed on China for job loss and currency manipulation. Manila Chan has that story tonight. In spite of the harsh words for China on the campaign trail, President-elect Trump struck a noticeably more amiable tone with Chinese President Xi Jinping. The pair spoke for the first time on Monday since Donald Trump won the U.S. presidential election less than a week ago. In President Xi's phone call to Trump, the leader of the world's largest developing economy told the soon-to-be leader of the free world that there are many areas in which the U.S. and China could cooperate and that cooperation was the only choice the two really have. Trump told press that, quote, China is a great and important country, and China's development is remarkable. That, according to Trump's transition team. The Chinese president told press that the two countries should promote economic development and global economic growth and push for better development going forward in China-U.S. relations. Presently, that relationship is severely off balance, with China ahead of the U.S. in a trade surplus to the tune of over $300 billion. That is China exporting a great deal more goods into America than the other way around. On the stump, President-elect Trump railed against China, citing that he would impose a 45 percent tariff on goods coming into the U.S., accusing China of unfair trade practices and even currency manipulation. That would have paralyzed bilateral trade. Today's phone call would appear to be a pivot on that position. The two have already agreed to maintain close communications and to meet real soon. For the news with Ed Schultz in Washington, I'm Manila Chan, RT.